we started the conversation, David, you took us sort of on a, a, a whistle stop tour of the history of analytics. This feels like it's the next step, right? We talk about now, you would never underwrite catastrophe risk without looking at models. Mm -hmm. I can very easily see a world where four or five years from now, it's like you would never do much of this work anymore without first having access to data like what, like what you present to Nova going, this is how we help guide what we do. Because it, why would, we, why would we write Florida cat without a model? Like you, you wouldn't anymore. And I, mm -hmm. I feel this will be the next sort of step of going, this is a, a, a ubiquitous piece of technology for how we run the business over the next several years. And it becomes a, when we talk about this in 15 years from now, they will have this as being one of the points where by which you saw another sort of sea change where, and then data allowed us to do this. Mm -hmm. And then we'll evolve and we'll continue to iterate and we'll have another one. But this feels like one of those big moments. I think that's right. If we achieve enough critical mass, then we really can change the way people are able to see the industry, the way people are able to analyze opportunities and the way people are able to strategize. We have put our proprietary data on Nova in an anonymized fashion. Again, we want to be the platform of choice for the industry to share its data. So we've, we've got a couple of different things in the hopper right now, but we'd like, we'd like as many underwriters as possible to share data with us. And if you're amenable, we can create an even bigger data source that could become really valuable industry-wide.